that we've um, got orders already for 2,000 toques that their kids are waiting uh-huh. for. Where are they That's now, then, those cool. toques? They're in my house. <laughs> They're in your house? I'm the main distributor. There are other distributors, but I'm, prim- I'm the primary distributor. I'm a volunteer. Wow. And we're all volunteers. That's a packed living and- room. Uh, I, uh, I have a room, room. <laughs> and then uh, I've already mailed off close to 2,000 yeah. since the beginning of October and to uh, Nunavut and, and um, northern BC. It's it's just means that they aren't getting through to these kids that, you know, need them. In, they really need them. It's mm. minus 35 and a lot of these children do not have hats. Um, hard to believe, but it's true. And uh, uh, all the hats are knit by volunteers, um, and uh, we get them out as fast as we can get them in. And uh, what are you yeah. hearing from from families uh, who are waiting for these toques? Well, we send them to schools, mm. and so they they are just very thankful to get them. They really they understand there's a strike, so they know they're not going to get them. But even Getting them to none of it is a challenge because they go in by plane. And so, um, you know, it's basically they're happy to get what they can get yeah. when they get it. But we'd like to get it to them as soon as possible because it's getting cold. Absolutely. And so right now, um, they're, I, I guess they're sitting and waiting. And, and uh, Yep, I've got them boxed and ready. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my goodness. Uh, every time I get a, a request, um I do up the boxes and get them ready. We also send socks and mitts when we have requests and when we have them. And, um, I mean, it's this was started by a single woman who just felt there was a need. And every year it's going up and up and up. And it's Mm -hmm. wonderful. We get pictures of the kids sometimes. And, and, you know, uh, these are people who really want to help these children. Are you able to look for an alternative at all, or is that not a possibility? Well, it is expensive to mail. Um, We do use the prepaid boxes because they are a bit cheaper, and I haven't gone to check for alternatives yet. Um, Depending on whether or not the strike goes on, um, I will try, but we aren't... uh, we don't have a lot of money. We sell cookies. We do all sorts of things just trying to get money to mail mm. these things to the children. 